Froggy's First Kiss It was the week before Valentine's Day, and for Froggy, Valentine's Day meant candy, but it also meant love. At school, Froggy's mind wandered. Froggy! cried his teacher, Miss Witherspoon. What? Kindly pay attention, dear. And that's when he saw the prettiest girl frog in the world, the new girl in class. Her name was Frogalina, and when she smiled at him, his inside got all soft and wiggly, like he'd had caterpillars for breakfast. Froggy! called his teacher. What? Your eyes should be on your work, dear. It's not polite to stare. Oops, said Froggy. At recess, Frogalina smiled at him through the monkey's bars. He was hanging upside down. And when he saw her, he fell smack on his head. Bonk! At lunch, Frogalina sat beside him. She smiled and opened her lunch box. I have a treat for you, Froggy. Close your eyes. And she gave him a big juicy apple. After lunch, Froggy and Frogalina played teether ball together. Frogalina wound up, sucked the ball, and Froggy was so busy gazing into her eyes. The ball hit him in the head, bonk, and knocked him down. At lunch next day, Frogalina smiled and opened her lunchbox. I have a goodie for you, Froggy. Close your eyes. And she gave him a cookie, shaped like a heart. That afternoon, Froggy and his class made valentines. They cut hearts out of paper. Some big, some little, some red some pink and on just one froggy wrote i love you he didn't want any of his classmates to see especially frogalina so he worked under his desk froggy called mrs witherspoon what please work at your seat dear and don't make such a mess then Froggy stood up. He hit his head on his desk. Bunk! And everybody laughed, especially Frogalina. At lunch, the next day, Frogalina sat beside him. She smiled and opened her lunchbox. I have a surprise for you, Froggy. Close your eyes. What do you think she gave him? A big, juicy kiss. Smack on his cheek. Blah! Splattered Froggy, looking more red in the face than green. Froggy grabbed his lunchbox and flopped away. Flop, flop, flop. His tummy felt so weird. He couldn't eat his lunch, not even dessert. On the bus after school, everybody teased him, even Max, his best friend. They sang, Froggy has a girlfriend, Froggy has a girlfriend. No, I don't, cried Froggy. When the bus stopped, he flopped all the way home, flop, flop, flop. But his heart felt heavy. Was it love? Was it hunger? Was it his backpack filled with Valentine's cards? What did you do at school today, Froggy? asked his mom. We made Valentine's, said Froggy. Did you make one for someone special? Froggy turned almost purple and flopped into his room. Flop, flop, flop. 
But the next morning, on Valentine's Day, Froggy served his mom breakfast in bed and said, Mom, that someone special is you. And he gave his mom the big heart with the I love you. And his mother gave Froggy a whole bunch of kisses. Candy kisses.